Hey everyone, it is February 13th, the day before Valentine's Day. Um, I haven't updated in a really long time and I'm sorry. I know a lot of people out there are wondering how I'm doing. Um, I've been doing really good. Chemo's been doing really, going well. Um, still kind of, you know, I feel tired and really sore and achy for about three days. And then I have pretty much 11 good days. And, um, I don't know. I just, I haven't updated because nothing too monumental has happened health-wise. Uh, I just, just hanging around Clarkson, just watching a lot of TV, trying to read some. Um, a lot of time spent on the computer. Um... A lot of people have asked me how the puppy thing went, and uh, that didn't go so well. Um, I got the puppies on a Friday and had to take them back on a Sunday because they were really loud, and we couldn't have them in my mom's apartment, so that didn't last long. Um, next time, if I try to do that, it'll be with an older dog that doesn't cry and howl so so much so it, that kept me entertained for about a weekend but um pretty much just occupying my time boredom is my number one enemy right now i need to i just can't find much to do around clarkston um but i'm hoping that once i start planning this fundraiser that i want to have then stuff will start picking up. I'll start doing stuff, finally. Um, yeah. There hasn't been much going on. Just, you know, I go to state a lot on the weekends to see my friends, and that re it really picks me up to go see all my friends, and, uh, honestly, I'm just bored. Um, that's the biggest problem. That's, that's about it. I have I really can't complain. I've really um I've kind of found myself through this process. So I'm not I I don't complain so much. You know the pain during chemo, like the days that, that I'm down and stuff. Yeah, I feel like crap and all that stuff. But I I try not to complain because it could be worse and. You know, I don't have any nausea or anything, so I could be, you know, puking constantly, but pretty much I just lay in bed for three days, so, <laughs> you know, I can't say anything negative, um, and, but yeah, back to the, uh, finding myself thing, I, the whole process of getting cancer at 19 has really just pushed me to grow up and to really appreciate life and to know what matters and to not put up with the little things anymore. I just, I don't care about a lot of stuff anymore. I just care that, you know, I'm breathing. What more could you ask for? And it's, I've just changed as a person dramatically. I am not the same person that graduated high school almost a year ago and I'm I'm glad. I'm I can't not say that I'm not happy. I'm very happy. So to say that I have cancer and I'm happy, I think is remarkable, honestly. But um yeah. I got my wig on, trying to do different things with it, see if, you know, make it look a little more real. All that. So yeah. That's about it for life right now. Um, thanks everyone for all the support and all the kind words and the mail and oh I want to have a special thank you to Ellie Vondette who made me these awesome bracelets look how awesome that is um, she's so talented at making these little bracelets I wear them every day they cheer me up every day so thank you Ellie and that's about it for now I'll keep updating my life's kind of boring now but I'll still keep updating. Alright, bye.